Okay, so a few extra things to mention when you're sorting out your camera. If you're setting it up for live streams, you might want to capture the audio from the camera. Can you do that? Well, yes, you can. I've done a little test. This is obviously a pro lens on there, but this is a 250D that I'm testing for live streaming. So this camera has a microphone port. What you do is plug this mic into your camera, just as such, and then you plug it to your HDMI out. What I did is I did a test video of it as such to show you that you can use just the camera. You can use a capture card. Let me show you my capture card there. And you can plug in wire HDMI and put it into your computer. Let me show you an example of how that sounds with and without the mic. And there was a slight difference. There's a bit of background noise on there, so that was interesting. But the settings in menu, I've done a full video on this camera about menus, so you can check that out for how I set this up. But I'm giving you an example now of how this sounds, and you can use it for live streaming in this type of environment. Uh, one thing to mention, which is ridiculous, is on this camera, the mic port is on the side of the display. How ridiculous is that? So now my display has a wire there, so I have to get a 90 degree, and that's long, I can't be doing that. So let me zoom this out. Let me give you a test video of the mic inserted. Can I record this as this? It's 24 mil, so it should be, let's see what we get. Okay, so this is a recording with the microphone attached to the camera, and how does it sound? I've attached the mic straight into the camera. This is the boom type mic that faces my face. I'm about hand distance away, so I could technically use it for vlogging. Let me hold it more pleasingly. There, that looks a bit better, doesn't it? So that's me looking at the camera. How does that sound? Now, I have plugged out the mic. This is the mic on the camera itself, so onboard audio. How does this sound? What do you think? Is it okay? That does look nicer, but I've taken the plug out. So let's check this out. Okay, so this is without the mic attached. Does it make a difference? Is this mic even working? It makes me question. Because I have plugged it in the wrong way, haven't I, douchebag? Okay, plug it. well, is there a right way or wrong way? Let's find out. Check, one, two, three, check. Okay, yeah, that's definitely the mic on the camera. Okay, so what I've just done now is I've put a microphone, plugged it into the camera to see if that helps. It's a Boya mic, the shotgun type. How does this one sound now? Okay, I need to do a test further away from the camera. So what I'm doing right now is trying to find a spot. That's the box there. So this is uh, about four feet away from the camera. So this is how it would sound if you were recording into the shotgun mic, four feet away. Let me take the mic out and see how it sounds without that shotgun mic now. That has to be the most dodgy place I put the camera. I've put it on top of the monitor. This is the mic on the camera built in. So how does that sound? Um, I've got a couple of tripods here, but I've just done a quick test here to let you know how that sounds. What do you think? Is that any better? Put that in the end of this video. I've done two videos about getting sound from your capture card. It is possible. So if you're telling me it doesn't work, you're, you're doing it wrong basically. I've used these capture cards for long enough and I've had enough comments about them asking me, can you do it? Yes, you can do it. Let me show you the OBS screen so you can see how you do it. Right now, there's my screen. I'm going to click the plus button. This is the point you're adding the camera. Video capture device. Let's just call it something like that so you know it's the right one. I'll do OK. Here is USB video. You'll see it's quite dark there, but it is actually on. It's just that I've switched off my lights while I'm recording the second bit. So that's the camera. All you do is go right to the bottom, use custom audio, audio device. device. You do, you do okay. okay. Now, now you'll, you'll hear, hear my voice, voice twice. twice. Let me... So there, you can see the top one. Oh, I've closed it. Let me make, make it, it small, small so you can so see, my, see desktop. my desktop. So now, so now here, here you can see, see a double, double voice. voice. One, one is, is from, from the camera. The camera. That, that one, two, one, two, one, two. one, is, one from is from the mic. mic. So if I, I double click on the camera, camera again, again and, and un untick use custom audio device and do OK, you'll see that camera one, two, one, two, one, two is no longer recording the audio, just my desktop mic. So let's go back here, double click on it, go right to the bottom, use custom audio, audio device. device. Okay, okay, so, so now, now the audio is coming, coming by the HDMI, HDMI. you can, can see, see it peaking there. there. You're probably hearing this twice because I've got it on my mic and this is the ca audio from the camera itself and now i'm going to turn the camera audio off and put my mic back on so that's how you do that in obs so i don't, I don't want, want to capture, capture the audio, audio via the camera, camera. But that, that is, is really loud audio for the camera, camera. We do capture, capture device two that is check one check one 
Okay, so that was the camera audio you were listening to. Now I've put it onto my custom mic. And what we will notice is everything's a bit sharper in it. As well as I need to adjust it slightly, make it nice. I need to make it 1.4. It's 2.8. Let me come right. So what have I done there? What I've done there is I've made the settings 160th of a frame, 1.4 and ISO 100. So how does that look? We'll have to compare that to the old video. Let's go back into the camera settings. Do what? So how does that look now? Does that look a bit sharper? Should do. Should be a lot sharper. So it shouldn't ever be out of focus. So that, oh yeah, see. So notice that. You see how that got blurry because it's following my face? So that's good. And it's, Okay, so that was a quick review of the camera and the mic setup. I've done a number of reviews on this camera and this setup for live streaming. So I'll link you to another video here, which you can check out and I'll see you on that video.